the glory himself. You will never, ever get tired of these pictures. We're all here. I'm actually made my way down to the bottom end of pit lane just to get everything sorted. But I walk back up to grab the thoughts of Davide. Eh? MotoGP so Indonesia 2024. To Danny Pedrosa. Scans, Highlights. Does Mark Marquez, who was confused with himself but, uh, in Mandalika. Uh, yesterday, uh, Danny yeah. Pedrosa was surprised by Mark Marquez's attitude of not wanting to attack Francesco Bagnaia in the 2024 Indonesian MotoGP sprint. Mark Marquez's bad record on the Mandalika circuit, Lombok has officially ended in the 2024 Indonesian MotoGP sprint session, Saturday, 28-9-2024. How could it not be? For the first time, the rider nicknamed Baby Alien was able to complete the race on the 4.3-kilometer track. The, the Along with the bad luck that Jorge Martin from Pramac Racing got who crashed on the first lap, Marquez managed to soar. An impressive start saw him enter the top five from the start of the race and eventually finish third. Coming off a bumpy qualifying session with two crashes, Marquez started the 13-lap mini-race from 12th position. This is the first time the 31-year-old rider has been able to complete the race in Mandalika after what happened in the previous two consecutive seasons. Unsurprisingly, the success of getting the 2024 Indonesian MotoGP sprint podium made Marc Marquez highlighted by Danny Pedrosa. Little Spaniard was surprised by Marquez's decision to not be himself by not putting pressure on Bagnaia. With a gap that is not too wide, the winner of eight world championship titles is considered capable of overtaking Bagnaia with his abilities. As a former teammate when he was still active at Repsol Honda, Pedrosa questioned one of Marquez's steps in this race. Instead of chasing and taking the lead, Marquez actually dropped one spot in the final laps because he was overtaken by Bagnaia's teammate, Enea Bastianini. To keep himself the most surprising thing is that Marquez himself. did not he take the decision to be Mark Marquez, said Pedrosa. He keeps going no matter what happens, he added, as reported by Bolasport.com from the Motosan page. On the same occasion, Pedrosa also praised Marquez, who had shown extraordinary fighting power. He had an unlucky qualifying session that cost him, said Donny Pedrosa. With Martin's mistake in crashing on the first lap and Bagnaia emerging as the winner, the competition for the world title became even fiercer. Names like Marquez and Bastianini still have a chance, although not as big as Martin or Bagnaia. With the mistakes everyone made, the world championship is still too open, Danny Pedrosa explained. Anything can happen. The top two riders, who want to win as many races as possible and try to win, made mistakes. And Bastianini is getting closer. Tomorrow he can be the fastest in the race, he added.